Hello, good morning, everybody. Hope everybody's doing great, doing awesome, doing wonderful. Hope you had a wonderful, wonderful weekend. It is Monday. Happy Monday! It's the first day of the week, the beginning of the work week, and on my way, and I'm on my way to work. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day, a blessed day. My name is Fritzy, and this is Life with Fritzy. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to another episode of Fritzy's Car Chronicles, Monday through Friday. If you are new to this channel, and you are new to my channel, welcome to my channel. If you like family vlogging, and you like inspirational and empowerment videos, this channel is for you. Please hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell. You know what I'm saying? So you can get with us, okay? And get into the groove. We jamming, we jamming, yes. So you can know, you can get, and don't miss any, any, any notifications here at the Diamond Base Crew. You know what I'm saying? Because we always popping, and we always locking, and we keeping it. We keep it real, people. Hold on, hold on. I'm trying to get something for you guys. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta get you in the mood here. Okay, we'll do this. You just meet me in the middle, middle, in the middle, middle. Yes. Hello. Okay. It was that was a short, 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 short song. But anyway, I get you on later. But anyway. So let's start our day with my jingle. Okay, so day with my jingle, right? Here we go. Here we go. Everybody know. <laughs> get your singing voice on. Get your spirits on. So if you're new here and you don't know about our channel, let me tell you. Every morning, Monday through Friday, we start our little jingle, a little jingle, our morning jingle to get you pumped and get you ready for the day, talk of the day, we're going to, we're going, you know what I'm saying, we're going to take out all that bad mojo, all that bad energy, all that negative energy and start our day fresh, so let's go, let's go with our little Diamond Babes jingle, all right, all right. All right, all right, here we go. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? How you been? How you doing? How you doing? How you been? Woo woo! How you doing? How you doing? How you been? What's popping? What's locking? What's popping? What's popping, babe? What's popping? What's locking? Yeah, 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 yeah. Ha oh, ha! Oh. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Woo woo! Yes, people, we are popping this morning. Yep, I know. Listen, it was not as ah, as exciting as I always do every morning, but you know what I'm saying? I woke up a little late this morning. Yes, and I did. I woke up a little late. I have not been today. I, last night I I had a little a little flare from a little sickness, and I have not been feeling. Well. I didn't sleep well last night, so because I didn't sleep when well, I didn't go to bed till like damn, like almost three something, four o'clock in the morning. First, I was ready in the video. Okay, I had to come back. I had to get that video edit and out the door because let's face it, it just I was tired. I needed to get one. I I had so many videos up. Plus, okay, let me get the latest one out. Let me get the one, you know. So um, I'm going to upload the second video um today. Tonight, when I get back home from work, I'm going to... I got finished editing that one. That one's a long one. Um, but I'm going to finish editing it. Editing, editing it. Editing it. Okay, can't, can't talk. So, I'm going to finish editing it. I'm going to um, I'm gonna put that out for you guys so you can see part two of today. Of of my weekend trip at the cabin. You'll say. You'll say. And I want to thank everybody for who are coming on the video. Thank you so much. Um, That was... a. Uh, that was one of my pride and joys a uh, video um that I wanted to get that out to you guys first. It's my inspirational video. I you know everybody knows I do inspirational vlogs. I do inspirational videos. I try to inspire everyone. I try to uplift everyone. I try to empower everybody. I try to bring lots of positivity to everybody so we can live a positive and enriched life. So I was very, very proud of that video. So 
I'm glad you liked it. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Um, it's just, it's just one of those things where I can get away and pull myself away from all this mumbo jumbo in this world and be able to bring myself back to me and just meditate and be able to be, you know, it's a good thing. You know what I mean? Like be able to strip myself of everything and just be like, you know what, God, I'm here in all your glory. I'm here just 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 renew me, you know what I mean, rejuvenate me, uh, make me a better person, I, I need to come back to reality, come back to myself, so that, that, that was a good, that was a good, good day, a good weekend, we had a wonderful weekend, oh my god, it was so good, it was so good, but I want to say, I'm sorry to my people, I'm sorry to my girls, um, to my girl Teresa. I love you, boo. I, you know I love you. Um, I always say sorry to my girl Stacey. Listen, I don't know I was talking to you, and I said, "Damn, I'm gonna call. I'm gonna call you, Teresa. So I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you when I get done doing what I gotta do." Between getting the videos, between uh, um, uh, washing clothes, getting stuff organized for today. Um, today's Columbus Day, so happy Columbus Day to all everybody. Everybody, happy Columbus Day to everybody. The kids don't have school. I have work because work don't give a shit about Columbus Day. Okay? They don't give a shit about Columbus Day. So we got to go to work. We got to make that paper so we can support and pay our bills and pay our rent, pay our mortgage, pay all this and support our children and eat. Okay? So on that note. So happy Columbus Day to everybody. Okay, now we got that the way. So... <laughs> It was a good, good weekend. It was a wonderful weekend. Um, between everything that was going on, Teresa and Stacey, I'm very sorry. I fell asleep. After I did all that, I didn't fall asleep. I was very, very tired. I had a little flare up last night. I was exhausted and I didn't get a chance to um call to call you or let you know, let you know that you can call me, whatever. And I apologize. I'm sorry, I still got something in my eye. Wow. So I apologize on that note. But oh no, let's get let's get to this video. So it was a good weekend. Yes, people. I enjoyed myself. My daughter enjoyed herself. My nieces enjoyed themselves. My Brad, my husband enjoyed himself, Brad. My uh, everybody. My in-laws, everybody. We had a good, good, good time. The pumpkin festival was nice. It was very nice. Lots and lots and lots of vendors. Lots of good food. Honey, wait till you see the video. Oh my God, wait till you see the video I'm going to upload today. Wait till you see the apple dumpling. The peach dumpling made right there. Right there, people. It was popping. When I say it was popping, it was popping. It was good. It was freaking good. And they had, they put the ice cream on top. Girl, you talking about a girl that loved me so good for Yes, it was good. Hiking was, was good. It was good. Walking in the, in the mountains, it was good. Walking by the creek. But guess what? You know why I had a flare-up? Because my body feeling it. My body feeling it. Honey, I used to walk and run around these rocks like nothing. Now I got to think about things before I do things. <laughs> I got to sit there like, hmm, pretty. Mm, are you going to feel this tomorrow? How bad are you going to feel it? And are you okay to go walk this mountain? I thought I was, you know, me. I thought I was a good old regular, you know, hiker. Pro, a pro. A professional. Yeah, the mountain showed me who was a professional. And it wasn't me. <laughs> I used to walk out of nothing and get up the next day walk like that. Now I'm like, yeah. I mean, I still do, but you know what? It's called body training. It's called training your body to a new lifestyle, a new and get back to the old you like you like things you used to do. That's what it's called. It's called body training. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna hurt. Yeah, I'm gonna be. Yeah, I'm gonna be sore because I am so my calves are hurting. Okay, I'm telling my mom. I don't know. I'm going to walk around too much. I mean, I, I do my stuff. I do my job. But I'm going to probably gonna be sitting a lot of times today. Because my body is feeling it, people. I'm feeling it. So, um, my back. I walk around my back. Like, I was like, damn. I feel like I'm nutty. I'm like, damn, grandma. I got the grandmamas. <laughs> I'm 
got the grandmamas. I'm like, ooh, I feel that in my bag. I got the kink, kink. I got the kinks of all kinks. Okay? Yes, that is me. But anyway, I digress. I'm okay, people. <laughs> that popped me a couple of pills. And I'm saying, and I'm all right. I'm all right. I don't take meds like that, but, you know, if I don't have to, I don't. But when I'm in pain like that, like today I woke up and last night I could not sleep and I had to flare up a whole flare ups last night. Yeah, I had to pop those. But anyway, I want to talk about something that it's a good, good thing. It's it's a wonderful thing. Um, You know how I always tell you guys that if you have any men's, Please make mends with anybody that you have um, any uh, any issues with, any problems with, any falling outs with. Maybe it's somebody that, you know, that you don't know like that, but like we always do, we pre like a lot of us do, and me included, because sometimes I, I'm guilty of that. I'm, I'm hey, listen, and I won't be fritzy if I'm not honest with y'all. And yes, I have been guilty of that in the past, judging people in the book of, you know, Judging people without even like, not like judging, but just like, well, you can say it's kind of judging, you know what I mean? Without even knowing the person, you know what I mean? Like, just like, uh, you know, that, that look at that, you know, or, you know, she should be, you know, just, you know, we always be like, oh, I don't think she should be doing that. Like, look at her, she out of pocket. But without even judging that, without even knowing that person, you know what I'm saying? Or just, you know, just having a falling out with a family member, a, a, a spouse, a loved one, an aunt, an uncle, a cousin, you know, a, a, a good friend that's like a sister, a sister, brother, your mother, your father, whatever, you know, and we, and we don't, we holding grudge, we holding on to things, um, holding on to negative, but I want to make this real quick, I don't want to make this 16, 17, 18 minutes long like I usually do, so I'm trying to get this out, so I want to, I want to, um, say a big thank you, um, to somebody very, very special, um, you know, and I say special because we're all special. You know what I'm saying? We're all, we're all beautiful people. And I want to say, um, today, last night, somebody made men's with me. And it was something that, you know, it was out of the blue. It was out of the ordinary. When I got back yesterday from my little vacay, <laughs> um, this person had reached out to me. Um, and I humbly thank that person. Um, because you don't know the impact you have on people. You know, that's why I always say to everybody, get to know me. Get Just take the time to get to know me. Get to know who I am. And I can get to know who you are. Because sometimes when you break yourself down and you be able, when you humble yourself, when you humble yourself and you be, and you be, and you tap into that humble part of your heart and open up your heart. And sometimes the person don't even have to, I know I'm, I, I'm already 13 minutes. I'm going to be long. I'm sorry, people, but I am. When you humble yourself and you let, when you let God do his work, you see the, the, the majesty of God and you see how we, how God wants us to live. Doors start opening for you. Your heart starts opening, your life starts opening, you start seeing beautiful things. You start seeing beautiful things evolve. Your whole life you're gonna see it evolve in front of you. And I wanna say thank you to this special person. Um, you know, it's not easy. Okay, I'm going and this is what I'm saying is it's not easy um apologizing. <laughs> Everybody knows that. We all know that. Oh, I, mean, I know that. I'm like, mm, I don't want to like a little kid. Mm -mm, no, I'm not. But when you humble yourself, and I have to give this person kudos because it's not easy coming and I say, hey, you know, I want to apologize for anything that I, for any wrongdoing that I have done, any bad thoughts I did, anything I said, I, t I, I judge you or I, I, I came at you without even knowing who you are. I came at you because I grew, I, I jumped on this bandwagon, that bandwagon, because it is what it is. And that's not easy to do for anybody. It's not easy. And I want to say, um, I humbly thank you. And I appreciate you. And, you know, it just takes a little humbleness in our life so that God can open doors. Because when you stop holding on to grudge 
and you stop holding on to anger and, and whatever's in wh whatever like the bashing and all that is in when you stop holding on to that and you start moving in a positive direction you're gonna see honey you're gonna see that god's gonna open doors for you because it just takes that one step that one step in front of you to make that change to make that change to be able to be like wow i was holding on to this for what I was judging this person for what? What I even know on this person? Just my thoughts because that's how our human brain works. But we have to retrain our brain to be like, not to be so judgmental and change our, and retrain our brain to take the time to get to know people. And you'll see, you'll see it's not what we think. It's not what we think. You know, we have to take our minds and our life there. You know what I mean? Because that's what God wants us to do. You know what I mean? That's how God wants us to live. He wants us to be able to live to love and and, and, and honor, respect one another. You know what I mean? Because when we do that, you're going to see. You're going to see God is good, man. God is great. And I always say, my mom always say, when you, when you move in silence, you have to observe. And when you observe, you're going to see God's going to start opening your eyes to things. It really is. So I challenge you today, another challenge today, to make amends with somebody. I say this every day, but I really, 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 really encourage you. If you have any falling out with anybody, any anything that's unresolved, go out and make amends with somebody. Go out and just observe people. Don't judge. Observe people. Mama always says, when you move in silence, move in silence. When you get when you get to know somebody, you gotta move in silence, people. You get don't be da -da 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 with this talking. Move in silence and just be quiet and open your ears and listen in your mind and see this person for who they are. And if you see a person for who they are, and you're like, damn, that person is not what I thought it was, or thought they were, or thought he or she was. It really is a genuine, genuine, nice person. Then you can move and be like, you know what, I'm glad to. But if you see this person, man, they're into toxic and stuff. Then you know you can keep it pushing. Be like, look, this ain't for me because I'm not about that. But get to know that person before you judge. Okay, that's my that's my thing. And my challenge to you is go out and make men to somebody. Open your heart to somebody. Open your life. Open your open your mind to that person. Get to know that person. Even if it's a stranger, you see somebody, get to know. Sit down and have a cup of coffee with that person. Get to know who that person is. So you can then be like, you know... Because when you start opening your mind and heart, you're going to see things happen. I preach this every day. When I, and everything I preach, I'm telling you, it became a reality. Because this person came to me humbly and I, and I appreciate that person. I had nothing but love for that person. And I thank you. I thank you and and me for the same way. Because if I ever have offended anybody, I apologize. I'm saying this to everybody out there. If I had maybe, you know, I don't know. Because what what we think may not be offensive to people, may, may be offensive to people, you know what I mean? But I always say I humble myself to everyone out there. If I said anything or didn't think that may I hurt you, upset you or anything, I apologize. I apologize because that's not, you know, we just don't know what we do and what we say. Sometimes we think it's okay and it's not. So I humble myself to everybody and I love y'all. I love you so much and I humble myself to you guys. So on that note, I gotta let you go because I'm already at 18 minutes. <laughs> I gotta go. This video is 20 minutes long, people. Okay. So I love you guys. Remember, stay up positive, stay inspired, stay motivated, stay inspiration. Most of all, stay empowered, people. Empower yourself, empower your life, empower somebody else's life, empower yourself to be a better you than it was the day before. Okay. On that note, let's see if we can, let's see if I can get you, I can get you pumped. Hold on. Yes, people.
every, every day above ground is what? A good day. I got to let you go. Happy Monday, everybody. Go out there and be blessed. Be happy. Share your love. Make men's. Please and humble yourself and love everybody. On that note, I got to let you go. All right. Love, peace, and a ball of hair grease. I love you, Diane Bay. Check you out. See you tomorrow. Love, y'all. Bye, Diane Bay. Check you out. Love you, Diane Bay.